In this lesson, you'll learn to add and subtract mixed numbers. For example, 2 and 3 fifths plus 6 and 4 fifths. Whenever you are performing operations on mixed numbers, it's usually easiest if you first convert the mixed numbers into improper fractions. So to solve this problem, let's first convert the two numbers into improper fractions. 2 and 3 fifths becomes 13 fifths, and 6 and 4 fifths becomes 34 fifths. Now just add the two fractions together. 13 fifths plus 34 fifths is equal to 47 fifths. Now rewrite the fraction to simplest terms. 47 fifths becomes 9 and 2 fifths. So 2 and 3 fifths plus 6 and 4 fifths is equal to 9 and 2 fifths. Let's look at another example. 7 and 1 fourth minus 5 and 1 third. Remember, to solve the problem, we can first convert the mixed numbers into improper fractions. 7 and 1 fourth becomes 29 fourths. And 5 and 1 third becomes 16 thirds. Now we must rewrite the fractions with a common denominator. 29 fourths becomes 87 twelfths. And 16 thirds becomes 64 twelfths. Now just subtract. 87 twelfths minus 64 twelfths is equal to 23 twelfths. Last, write the answer in simplest terms. 23 twelfths becomes 1 and 11 twelfths. So 7 and 1 fourth minus 5 and 1 thirds is equal to 1 and 11 twelfths. Let's look at one last example. 8 and 1 half minus 7 and 2 thirds. Remember, to solve the problem, we can first convert the mixed numbers into improper fractions. 8 and 1 half becomes 17 halves. And 7 and 2 thirds becomes 23 thirds. Now we must rewrite the fractions with a common denominator. 17 halves becomes 51 sixths and 23 thirds becomes 46 sixths. Now just subtract. 51 sixths minus 46 sixths is equal to 5 sixths. 5 sixths is already in simplest terms. So 8 and 1 half minus 7 and 2 thirds is equal to 5 sixths. In the remainder of this lesson, you'll get practice solving addition and subtraction problems with mixed numbers by first converting the mixed numbers to improper fractions.